friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anurudin Khan and I am a student and I am here to help other students. So, let's begin. Our today's topic is time. Measuring time. We measure time using these two clocks. The first one is analog clock in which the hour end is smaller than the minute hand. And the second one is the digital clock where 3 is showing you the hours and 0, 0 is showing you the minutes. Time interval questions. If start time and the end time is given, so duration is required. So the solution will be subtraction of start time and the end time. Number two, if start time and duration is given and end time is required, so you will do addition of start time and duration. Number three, if duration and end time is given and start time is required, so you will do subtraction of end time and duration. Example number one, Maureen started her homework at 7.20 p.m. She finished it at 8.05 p.m. How long did she take to do her homework? Here, start time and the end time is given and duration is required. So what you will do? Yes, you will subtract start time and end time. Solution 8 5 minus 7 20. Steps In subtraction, if we have to subtract larger number from a smaller and minor side, we will add 60 and subtract 1 from our side. It is very easy as simple subtraction. Here, we will add 60 in 5, so the answer will be 65, and then we will minus 1 in 8, and answer will be 7. 65 minus 20 is 45, and 7 minus 7 is 0, so our final answer is 45 minutes. Example number 2. A car arrived at a town at 15 6 hours after traveling for 4 whole 1 over 4 hours. Find the time the car started the journey. Here, 1 over 4 means quarter and quarter means 15. Here, end time and duration is given and start time is required. So what we will do? Yes, we will subtract end time and duration. Solution 15 6 minus 4 15. Here, 6 is smaller than 15 so we will again add 60. So answer will be 66. And then we will reduce 1 from 15 and our answer will be 14. So 66 minus 15 is 51 and 14 minus 4 is 10. So our final answer will be 10 51. Example number 3. James notes it takes 2 hours and 45 minutes to drive from his house to beach. If he leaves at 5.40 a.m., what time should he arrive at beach? So here... Start time and duration is given and end time is required. So what we will do? Yes, we will add start time and duration. Solution 540 plus 245 is 785. Steps. If we get an answer in which minute side is greater than 60, then we subtract 60 from minute side and add 1 to our side. So here, we will minus 60 from 85, so our answer will be 25, and we will add 1 from 7, and the answer will be 8. So our final answer will be 825. If you guys want to practice more, I will just provide you worksheets. Just subscribe and comment your name. Guys, please subscribe, like, share, and comment because I have done too much effort in it. Thanks for watching.